Hi children, this is a part of class 5 maths in the chapter the fish tail. Today we are going to understand the difference between digit and a number. Can you please tell me how many stars are these? Yes, there, here, there are two number of stars. What is this two? This two is a single numerical symbol that we have assigned to a particular quantity. So, in the same way, how many number of stars are these? Yes, these are three number of stars. So, what is this three? This three is a single numerical symbol that we have assigned to this particular number of quantities. So, in our lower classes, we have learned the symbols for these quantities from 1 to 9 and if there is no quantity here we have assigned a symbol called as 0. So these single numerical symbol that which we have assigned to a particular fixed quantity is called as a digit. Then what is a number? Now, can you please help me in counting how many stars are these? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. 10. What is this 10? This 10 is not called as a digit whereas this is called as a number. Why this is called as a number? Because it is made up of combination of 2 or more than two digits this is called as a number so what is a number number is formed by the combination of two or more than two digits what is a digit digit is the single numerical symbol that we have assigned to a fixed number of quantities now you might have understood the difference between digit and a number Digits are limited. How many digits are these? These are from 0 to 9. So, there are 10 digits. But how many numbers are there? There are unlimited number of numbers. The same way as how you have it in any language. In any language, we have fixed number of alphabet. But the words that are formed from this alphabet are unlimited. As if in this case. Now, we are trying to understand how different digits can be formed. So now here we have formed 10. 10 is the smallest digit that can be formed using these digits from 0 to 9. What is the speciality of 10? 10 is the smallest two digit number that can be formed using two digits. What is the smallest two digit number that can be formed using two digits? That is 10. So can you tell me what is the largest two digit number that can be formed using these digits? Yes, the largest two digit number that can be formed using these digits is 99. Then, what is the smallest three digit number that can be, means if you are using three digits, what can be the smallest number that can be made using these? Yes, it is 100. And what is the largest? Three-digit number that can be made using this is 999. Now we can proceed like this. Now, not only numbers can not only be made by using the digits from 0 to 9, but there is one more very important difference in between digit and a number. That all digits are numbers, but all numbers are not. This can be see now when we are talking about this particular case 3, this 3 is a digit as well as a number because this is a symbol as well as it is made up of this. But now when we are talking about 10, 10 is not a digit, it is only a number. 10 is not a digit, it is only a number. Now though it is made up of two digits, how many digits are there in this? Only two digits are there. So, now let us try to understand that how numbers can be made using digits. Now, we are trying to understand how numbers can be made using given number of digits. 
and what is the difference in between them we are trying to understand so now if the digits given are there are two digits that are given 2 and 3 what are the numbers that can be formed using these two digits yes so one number that can be formed using these two digits is 23 and can there be other number that can be formed yes the other number that is formed is 32. is there any difference between 23 and 32 yes there is a lot of difference in between 23 and 32. 23 is made up of two tens and three ones so three is in ones place and two is in tens place in 23 whereas 32 is made up of three tens and two ones so two is in ones place and three is in tens place in 23 in 32 sorry so using the digits 2 and 3 we can make two numbers that is 23 and 32 though they are made up of the same digits they have a lot of difference in between them that is a very important point we should understand now if there is a three digits that are given if there are three digits that are given so how many numbers can be made let us try to understand now if three digits are given 1 2 and 3 so how many numbers can be made using them so first we can make 1 2 3 which is called as 123 then keeping one fixed let us try to change the other to 132 now in the so this is in ones place tens place hundreds place now you keep two fixed and you keep a one and three 230 now keeping two fixed let us interchange these numbers 231 now what will be in hundreds place yes three will be in hundreds place if you keep three in hundreds place now one two three hundred and twelve and three hundred and interchanging them three hundred and twenty one this is the way in which we can write the numbers using the given digits but if you observe here there is a smallest number that can be formed using these three digits what is the smallest number that can be formed using these three digits that is 123 this is the smallest number and what is the largest number that can be formed using these three digits yes obviously it is 331 so now if you understand if you observe it very clearly uh, carefully you can understand that the smallest number can be written by writing the numbers which are by writing the digits which are given to us in ascending order can you see this one is the smallest two is bigger than this and three is bigger than this simply if you write the digits uh, given in ascending order we can get the smallest number the same way if you write the digits in ascending order means first the biggest then the next one then the next one like that if you write then you get the largest number that can be formed using some given digits now let us try to do it with a, a four digit number can you write the smallest as well as the largest number using some given digits like four three seven and nine these four digits are given can you write the smallest number yes what is to be done to write the smallest number that can be formed using these four digits first you should write the smallest number ascending order so three then then it is four then seven and nine so this is in ones place tens place hundreds place and thousands place so three thousand four hundred and seventy nine is the smallest number so we have to write it in ascending order so it is first 9 10 7 4 and 3 so 9743 is the largest number that can be formed using these okay dear children now it is the time for your assignment now this is the smallest small assignment that is given for you please try to do it so in the next class we will try to understand the answers for this and we'll go for the next topic hope you understood this thank you and have a nice day